What's up everybody? Today we are going to try to get you more consistent, making more putts, and saving a little bit of money. Alright, so what am I talking about? Well, it's really simple and it's going to be a quick tip for Tip Tuesday and it involves your putters, like I said. Uh, I prefer two matching putters, stamp and color and weight. I want them matching. I want them matching and you're going, why, why, why matching? Well, I'll give you a quick example. Say this one had a blue stamp and this one had a red stamp. And I threw the red stamp in the water that day on one of my putts, trying to hit a 30 footer downhill when it went in the water. Oops, now I gotta go the rest of the round with the blue stamp putter. Uh oh, I was missing all my putts in the warm ups with my blue stamp putter. And dang nabbit, I want that red stamp putter back all around. Now I'm just, ugh, they're never gonna go in. It might sound silly, but I've watched it happen more times than you can even think. Somebody loses their one of their main putters, and it's just, it's not the same. It's not the same, and they'll say it, and like, man, I really wish I had that putter. Get you a pair of matching putters. That's going to help consistency. Uh, saving money. Saving money, okay. So you got, your, you got your two matching putters. I see so many people do this, and it's just, it hurts my head. And, and I just couldn't ever imagine doing it. Say you're, dump, you're dumping the bag, you're like, oh man, it's a putter hole, I'm gonna throw all my putters, and then you, you pull the putters at the top of your bag, at your putter pouch, off the side of your bag, and you throw your putting putters. <laughs> what? Why? No. No, 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 don't do that. These have been used for months. These have been used for months, they're banged up, they're yellow band, chastity belted, they're chewed up on the sides. The tops and the, the flight plate, everything is board flat and they're super, super straight. They are no wobble, no dings, dents. They're, they're not warped. They're on the top, perfect. On the sides, they're banged up from hitting chains and band, preferably more chains. Your throwing putters, are warped. Why are they warped? Well, you're going to hit things. You're going to hit trees, you're going to hit roots, you're going to hit fences, you're going to hit buildings, you're going to hit the basket. Um, th you don't want to spend so much time putting with this, with these putters. Okay, so you, 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 get, you, get, you get your putters and you're putting with them. And then you go to reach for them the next time and you put your hand on it and you're like, what is that? Why, why does my thumb sit like it normally does? There goes your consistency. And now it's in your head as well because the putter just doesn't feel the same. Don't throw your putting putters. They are putting putters. Don't do it. The best example I can give you is, other than some random trick shots, you don't see ball golfers driving with their putter. Leave the putter for the green and put it away. Get you some Throwing putters! <laughs> Treat them just like every driver, every mid-range, every fairway. You're going to have some putters. I have a PA3 in the 200 series plastic and a PA3 in the 300 series plastic. Shout out, Emmercoaster's Golf Club. What's up, what's up? And they are going to be thrown. They're going to get beat in. I'm going to replace them. They're going to have different flights. And I'm going to treat them just like every other disc in my bag. If I dump my bag and my throwing putters are still in my bag, they're staying in my bag. Just think about that. Just, just if it's all, if you're going, Rob, what the heck? What are you talking about? Just, just, if you spent months, years, days, hours learning to putt with putters, the certain putters, I should say, and you get in the consistency of the grip, the consistency of that feel, don't jeopardize it by a chance to hit a tree. Now you might say, hey Rob, it's the hole's wide open. I'm just going to throw my throwing putters. You go ahead and you're going to almost ace it. It's going to hit the band or hit the cage and it's going to taco. That's going to suck. <laughs> so it don't matter if the hole's wide open. Just don't do it. They don't come out of my bag when I'm at doing field work. They don't come out of my bag when I'm dumping my bag. They are going to stay in my bag for putting and putting only and they're going to last way months, 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 months longer than these guys. 
they're never going to change other than just the random dings and dangs and things and things that happen to them. So, uh, I hope I didn't ramble too much, but I hope you get the point. You got your throwing putters, and you got your putting putters. It's going to keep you more consistent. Hopefully, it's going to save you more money because you're not going to be chewing up putters as much because you're just going to be putting with them. Remember, keep the putter in the bag until it's time to putt. So, yeah, guys, um, the winners of all the giveaways, I know I haven't really done an announcement. I'm sorry. I actually just got in touch with everybody privately. Um, I'm kind of debating on how I want it because I don't want to just put up a random video just to say, hey, the winners are. Unless you guys like that, I will do that if you guys like that. Um, but the winners this time, I just direct messaged him and I've been in contact with them and I haven't mailed them out yet. I'm mailing them out Monday. So let me know in the comment section if you want to see videos with me announcing the winners or, or do you want me to announce the winners in like a new video that I'm doing a review of a new disc? Let me know. Let me know. Uh, feedback. Feedback. Help us grow. So, uh, yeah, until next time, guys, like the video if you liked it. Share the video if you know someone that you watch them throw their putting putters into a tree and you just sit there. Maybe you let them do it on purpose. Are you that guy? Don't be that guy. So, if you liked the video, guys, as always, hit that subscribe button, and I will see you next time.